In today's video, I'm going to be going over one of the best glitchy defensive schemes right now in Madden 25. Now, before we get into it, make sure to hit the like button, sub to the channel, and check out my other Madden videos y'all boys see on the screen right here. I do nope. other Madden content besides defense offensive videos, so make sure y'all boys go check those out. Nope. But this defensive scheme, it works for Mutt, Rex, stop the run. You can, you know, stop the run. You can stop the pass. Whatever you need to stop, this defense will do it. So make sure you hit the like button, sub to the channel, and I see our boys in these setups. Let's get right into it. Nope. So right here on the screen, uh, the defense I want to show y'all is the 4-3 even 6-1 defense. A specific way you want to set this up is by simply going to your coach adjustments and have auto flip on off, auto alignment base, and then aggressive option defense. Okay. Now you don't have to run aggressive. You can run conservative. And some people do run zone drops. Me personally, you know, I don't really touch them too much unless needed. But you know, it just really depends on who you're playing against. Okay. Then what you're going to do is go ahead and come out and four three even six one, but come out and cover four quarters right here. And you want to flip this to where now I don't know if y'all boys can see it, but like it doesn't look like I'm flipping it as much, but. If you look at the, the deep blue zones at the top right there, deep blue zone right here, one is like, I guess shorter than the other. You can tell when you flip it. So like, I'm gonna run it, the long one on the left side right here, okay? And then what we're gonna do is come on the offense right here. Boom, let's see right here. Uh, let me see, boom. Now what you're gonna do is, the first way you can set up this defense is by show blitzing, by pressing wide triangle your controller, right bumper show blitz. And then you wanna move your D line or shift it to the left side like this and then slant to the left okay and then blitz your user and then we're only going to send a four-man pass rush right here shade underneath the cancel out match coverage okay and what you want to do it for this four man four man pass rush to come in is you want to hold the left trigger so you can engage with the center so you can get this guy to come in free which is the dt right there so boom you see right there that dt does come in and then you after you engage you're going to engage for like a second it's going to auto engage you a little bit and then you can run off and then you can just go back to the line to like the line of scrimmage right so you're going to see right here right here boom we snap it you see how this dt like basically he's about to come in free right my users occupying two linemen which allows this guy to come in free you got this guy off the edge and then eventually like with this pass rush that these guys are going to come in they're, they're going to come in the block shares are you get crazy block shares out of four three even so watch right here boom boom and you see right here my user can get back out to the middle of the field wherever i need it to be and that's what y'all boys want okay now the second way y'all can run this defense is by simply show blitz okay after you show blitz what you want to do is shift your d-line back to that left side and then you're going to send a five-man pass rush right here right so you're going to slide to the left again and then this is how it's going to look well this time you're going to send it off this right side say you want to send it off the right side right you're going to blitz a this linebacker right here you want to put a container on the field shade underneath okay so this is how it's going to look boys now you can blitz your user to help this pass rush come in so then now it's like a six-man pass rush but it's really only a five man but it really just it really just depends on what you want to do but you're going to see right here this guy is going to come in free off that right side boom and that's a free b right there now the contains are important because i online a, a lot of people tend to do is when you when they see you shift your d-line to one side they like to scramble to that right side so if you shift it to the right they like to scramble to the left it is how people is how people play right and having that contain on the field is going to help a lot. I'm telling y'all boys, okay? And then it, even if you don't want to put a contain though, even if you don't want to put a contain off that right side, this, that guy still is going to come in for that. You're going to see right here, he's going to come in right there. Boom, great defense. And you're going to see that's great defense. He's going to come in free, okay? And if you want to, if you are aware about the flats or whatever it's called, right? You can put uh, a cover three on the field. And one thing I love about, one way I love, I love running cover three is run something like this, right? So you will put like this guy, I'm gonna put him in the middle third, put this guy in a uh, curl flat shade underneath, or you could put him in a curl flat at all. Put him in a curl flat and then press Y or triangle your controller and press protect the stakes like this. And this is how it's gonna look. And you can see right here, you could run it like a simple cover three like this and putting this X guy on the line, uh, this line back right here, X and a vert hook. Like you could just run so many different coverages. And if you want to, you can put your user in a zone, like a hook curl, and you can just switch stick around. However you prefer to run your defense, but this is just some ways y'all boys can run it. And you're gonna see right there, boom, switch stick, switch stick, great defense. Right there, the pressure didn't come in as free as it should have, like it should have. And that's mostly because we probably, because we just didn't bless our user right here. But you see right, oh, he did get chip block right there, boom. 
and you see right there the pressure didn't scream as much right but you're going to see like you're going to get pressure but you're still going to get pressure though. you're still going to get pressure and by blitzing your user is going to help a, a, like a lot a lot by blitzing your user um because it's going to help engage with the pass rush help engage with the offensive line you see right there we get they get chip chip block again which like online just not going to happen and one thing i do want to tell y'all blitzes on practice mode are different than blitzes how they're going to work in game so they might not work in practice mode you get online and it works perfect so make sure your boys hit the like button sub to the channel these are just two different ways your voice can run a blitz out of four three even six one so make sure you hit the like button sub to the channel and i'll see you next video peace